guys, it's Games and Tuts here, and what do you say we go ahead and say that we can't say see that? Blah. And this is just a big room, and we are in a adventure map scenario. Um, and we have to get this bridge down, or we have to get that wall down so that we can get over, and it ends up being a bridge that we pass over lava for. Um, so how are we going to do this all? Well, I'm going to teach you that today. Um, without any huge contraptions where you have to dig out the water and do whatever so that it goes the other way when you hit a lever. Uh, that's actually not a huge contraption, but I'm just saying. Um, we're going to go ahead and use something that Ethos Lab pointed out in his water tutorial um, on breeds. Um, so I'm going to have to do this pretty quick here. Um, I'm going to place water and then place uh, that. There we go. Okay. So, um, reed can only be planted next to water, but once the water is removed, the reed will stay until a block next to it updates, right adjacent to the, the reed. So we can delete this block, and then the water's behind there, and the lever is right behind this block, so that will cause this block to update, and uh, this reed to break and fall, causing this gravel to fall down, and the water to come out. The water will uh, look for the shortest way down, so it'll take this and not spread all over the place. It'll take this, uh, run through here. Uh, it was a little short and it stopped right before that. I don't know why. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I do. Um, anyways, it'll uh, come down here and then um, it'll go down again, break those torches and cause a chain reaction with the gravel falling down. So, let's go ahead and test that right now. And there it is, just enough to walk through, and then a bridge over lava. So, I hope this taught you a little basic uh, stuff about uh, adventure maps, if you're trying to make one or something. Um, and sorry for any lag that happens during the video, I really uh, don't have a, that great of a computer. Um, so yeah, but uh, yeah, there's your tutorial, or not to really a tutorial, just, uh, just a uh, little run through on uh, something you can do with Reed. And uh, that's all thanks to Ethos Lab, so I'll go ahead and thank you, uh, give you your thanks right now. And um, link... I'm going to link Ethos Lab in the description uh, so that if you want to watch his water tutorial, if you're a little confused on how water works, then you can go ahead and check that out and check out where I learned that read trick. So, thank you for watching, and I uh, will see you guys next time. Bye bye.